Hi, I want to make a video about about coverage of unsafe in Rust. You know, because I heard I someone on the internet just randomly defend Rust to say, hey, you need to just grab all the unsafe because unsafe is very rare, and you're done. Okay, but I I seriously doubt that's correct. Because if we're using Gecko, then which is one just written in a very large part with Rust, and in that file, so I just search the search on C. What I find is that over a hundred pages of unsafe, you know, this is not a small number of unsafe, right? Maybe it's just messed with C++ code or other code here, right? But if we look at this empty file, we see unsafe is everywhere, right? Every lines of code are unsafe. I think probably unsafe is going to be more because now they have this unsafe of in unsafe fun thing. Right, I just I mentioned before. They just literally unsafe all functions. Okay, this is not even the C binding. They just unsafe all functions. But I really want to see what's the real counter with it. I cannot do that directly because GitHub has this restriction on how many times you can search in the search here. So I cl clone the entire project and grab all the unsafe. So I search the unsafe in the VS code and only include Rust files. The, 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 it, it's, it has so many unsafe that you cannot even do anything, right? It tells me around 20k of unsafe. Okay, of unsafe function. Uh, unsafe, unsafe keyword. This is not mentioning things probably like unsafe or being unsafe home. They're going to add a more unsafe. But, but you might say how, how, how large it that is because they might have millions of files. Let's just assume they have millions of files, then it's not a problem, right? So I, I write a program to count all the files they have here, which is counting all the extensions with, with Firefox. I use file system. I just recursively call all the files here to count all the RS files. And we call, we also count other languages to see to make a comparison. Okay, to see how many, uh, how many, how much code they have in entire um, the entire entire code base. So, so this is the, the program runs and yeah, we can just you might say what about this program? Whether it will have memory safety problems itself, right? Because people are like just saying C plus plus is all memory safety bugs everywhere. Then, then, then just using plan plus sanitizers, whatever, we can just enable sanitizers to see whether you have problems, right? Just undefined. Maybe we're gonna see some warnings I'm gonna fix. Maybe we won't see warnings. I just enable all the warnings I know. No, no warnings at all. Then we run the program. Right. No, no bugs at all. The coin, the sending does it doesn't crash. So, which is eight eight thousand, eight 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 thousand and two. Okay, so we have eight thousand of Rust files, eight thousand and two hundred two eight thousand two hundred and sixty two. So, how many unsafe files here? We have. 1066. If we take a just to see what the percentage of of, of, of this, okay, of, of, of the Rust file that contains the thing here, which is 20%, which is right, which is which is 94%, right? 19.5, percent it's just basically 20%, which means you have 20% of file, Rust files that has unsafe and the unsafe count is 20k okay 20k plus all these fires are 
all the unsafe here, plus all the asunders problems. I, I just feel a lot of asunders problems inside the rust fires, whatever. How do you know? How do you grab those things? How do you grab those fires? You have 20% of rust fires that use these unsafe, and unsafe counties 20k. This is not a small number. You have 20k of unsafe, okay? Maybe I should make another view on the thing here to see what the proportion with it. But but in general, you know this a lot of unsafe. And how do you grab those things? How do you grab 20k of unsafe in a, this is a real world Rust program, right? Because Rust love to Rust 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 folks love to say how the successful story of Firefox. This is a successful story. Still, C plus plus fire around, around thirty five thousand, right? You have only one, just less than one one fourth are not C plus are are Rust fires, and so, so now you have so many unsafe. Right, this is just literally so many unsafe, right? You just have 20% of fires that the hunt contains unsafe. How can you do grab those things? You say you click grab and save. How do you do this? Okay, I don't know. Okay, maybe you can it's it's not real, right? Because unsafe is clearly not real, right? It's not real. It's not like grass folk saying it's, it's, it's I'm doing statistics, right? Statistics shows you it's not real, right? It's nowhere real. You have more unsafe. There's so many unsafe, right? So, uh, so please don't listen to them. They just they are just wrong. The Ross folks are wrong, they are just super wrong. Of course, they're gonna blame C for the violating human rights. They're gonna write a bunch of garbage code with 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 the, with the C plus plus that then 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 whine about it. They don't even in a upgrade standard, they don't want to use a standard, of course. I'm using C plus twenty three and I enable sanitizers, all warnings, no warnings, no sanitizers, no crash. That's not what their code is doing, right? It's not their code is doing they're gonna blame C++, whatever. So that's about the video. And I, I hope there's some statistics to show here. There is no statistics. People just don't show any good statistics. Just very wrong. All those things are very, very wrong.